Mr. Bengal! Oh, that's nasty. Hello. Well, folks, we just got down this bit. <laughs> and like the other one, it's uh, probably another 10 foot to the next drop. We're just waiting for everyone to get down. Pass us that blue bag. Cheers, mate. That's all right, ladder. We are joined by Secret Vault. Woohoo! Just uh, John Bengal Banks. Hello. In Mysteries. Hello. And uh, Bacon Haven, just in the background there. And today we are at Wimbledon Common Rotorbucker. Wimbledon Common. That's the one. <laughs> Gonna be an epic one once we get down, so uh, we'll pick it up. Everyone be on there. Just see Alex in the background. Yeah. Good at time knots. Especially for his hostages. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be good at knots to be a skipper. Yeah, none of them have escaped yet, have they? No. <laughs> Just tell me how much to pull this so that it, it, it's got it's got tension in it and they're both level, they're not like slanting off. I need to see how far down it goes. How far? Don't, let it, don't let it just drop into the water, that's fine. It's all the way to the bottom, mate. Yeah, okay. It is all the way to the bottom. Just pull those over the edge tight. So really you have to lift yeah. it. And I need it to go tight. I need to tell how much to let one side off or on. I think that's good, isn't it? No, it's still a bit slack here. Yeah. Let it go over the edge. Uh, yeah. Don't be pulling back, John. We want to be pushing forward towards oh, okay. the edge. That's it, you got it. Hang on, a bit more slack to go. Tight. Hang on. Pull it nice and tight. Both sides. I think we have to let off the, this side a bit. Has I'll anyone go looked go over the edge yet, there. apart from... I guess no one has, has there? Alright, It's very flooded. Is it? Yeah. We should be alright though. Because there's little should girders. Walk across it like, quite nicely, though. Yeah. Cool. Just don't just don't put a foot wrong, otherwise you go and then probably is that about three foot would you say? Yeah, about three foot. It's difficult because the water um scatters the light, doesn't it? Yes. It's not like the other one we went to where we had luxury of a nice dry wooden floor at the bottom. Steve, see yeah. that black that blue bag to the side of you. you put that underneath the end ropes to uh, fold it over. <laughs> Bag so that it's over the edge properly. Okay, just so that it stops the chain fitting out. Do you want to go or do you want me to go while I'm here? You can go if you want to go first. Right. We need knee pads for this, guys. There you go, in the last video. Just, just hold on to the, uh, the ropes as you go in. Did you hear that? Like? Oh, I did hear that, yeah. Oh, that oh, right, I'm starting to put some weight on it now. Hopefully not round two of my bovlov. Fingers crossed, it's not too <coughs> skewy. Yeah. Nice to mix. Good night, Steve. One of them has a big gap between Yeah, them. there's a massive. Yeah. Go on, I tell you. Yeah, I'm just going to move out of your way, so I'm on the dry bit. Right, now comes Matt, down our rope loader. So I'd say that's a good, good 16 feet, I'd say that is. Drop yeah. down to the bottom there. Right. Yeah. As you can see, guys, probably about three foot water depth there. Might not look here, but it is about that. 
Wow. So who's the next one? Is that Bengal? Just Bengal. You got it. Good. Yeah, good. just keep on the sides and then uh, you got concrete there, yeah, so it's all good. So, yeah, look at that, guys. Nice. Look at that. Wow. Fantastic. What a beauty. And comes Alex. Where your left foot is, that's oh, rotten to hell. Yeah, yeah, that's I, I just realised that, I didn't realise that before. Mm. <laughs> right, when you come down the bottom and you come off the last step, don't step down the oh, What was that? What just dropped there? No idea. That Rock. sounded metal. Rock or something? Mm. Yeah, just um, when you get down to the bottom, you see where the last rung is? Yeah. Don't mm, step on that. Walk and go in. Step this is the bit we've been waiting for. Don't step on that last rung. Ray's uh, bricking it, so I want to order some further bricking. Okay, we're uh, <laughs> keep it down. Get it up from the wall if you can. I'll try it. Shuffle it out. That's it. Just see if we shuffle it out a bit more. I'll set it down. Yeah, you're alright. Use your, if you can. Use, use your hand on the, get your hand down the back of the rope and pull the rope out. Yeah, so, so you were there. So you get, you get your hand down on the rope and just lift it away from the wall a bit. Anybody pull it out down there? Yeah, possibly. There you go. Right, foot to the right, Ray. Get more to the right. That's it. Now you've got plenty of room for the left then. That's it. And now it will stay out because Alex is holding it out, so. Don't hold it out too far. Oh, yeah. It's about two foot per step. Four more to go, mate, and you're done. Switch the shirt to do that now. Oh, hang on. That's all right. <laughs> so you can slide, man. Yeah, it's hard to do that. Put your, put, put your weight on your right foot. There we are, balance it out. Keep your weight on your right foot, go down with your left. Don't do that, don't do that. The, the rope pad is going to go away from you. That's it, keep your foot on the right, more on the right. That's it, because the right is a little bit high, so if you keep pushing down on the right, it balances it out. Now, don't step on that shit. Yeah, yeah, you got it. Nice one. Right, folks, we are finally down. We are just going to walk this first corridor and um, see what's down the other end. Interesting to see what it's like versus the other one we did at Beachy Head. Um, so, again, it used to be a little guard house. So, this is typical of the road workers. It used to be a little guard house at the top, which was like a decoy house. So, it didn't really make it obvious it was actually a radar station bunker. And that would literally just sit above the main entrance to this place. And there's sort of a couple of escape hatches as well, which we'll see along the way. So I'll just turn the camera around. And I don't actually believe it. If you've watched our last video, this goes on for about three times the length of this. And they bricked it up. I do not believe it. Unfortunately, guys, this part of it is where he's locked up. Right, can you see through the top? Oh no, they've double bricked it. Yeah, you can't even see through. No. That's not even really severe. No. Yeah. Well, that's brutal. It's so just a cheap, cheap job. Because somebody's blocked that off because they don't want to come in from the, uh, the other side. From the other side, which was the possibly underneath the Wimbledon Common. Am I, I reckon the public toilets on the Common ah. are above that. That's probably where. The hatch might be where they build a new block of toilets on top. Right, okay. What do you reckon? You could check it from the top, couldn't we? Oh, that's a shame, Matt, because the other one went straight up, didn't it? Yeah. So we're in a slight angle now, folks, so it's cool. coming down, I don't know, what, five degrees? 
I'm going to go seven. Yeah, lovely. A little bit chilly actually, to be fair. Oh, yeah, oh, it's quite it's nice. 13 degrees in the underground. Oh, is that magic 13? Yeah. Amazing. Can I jump this? Amazing subs, yeah. Oh, Don't start with that, Steve. Of course you can. Oh, and the bob log went. <laughs> Just a foot from the water as well. Three and three, I didn't say anything after today. Mmm, you did. Here's the oil, where they took the transformers out, we need the oil. Probably give it a sort of urine. Yeah. So I seem to remember in the other one, guys, there was like a little metal cage. It went along the top. You can kind of just see the um, remnants of where it went in. But yeah, that's some really old. Bits and pieces in there. Yeah, when these buses get sealed up for so many years, literally decades, this I don't think has been seen for a long, long time, probably at least 10, 20 years even. So it's always a privilege to come in and see these. Look how still it is. Original colour doesn't look like it's been burned out or anything. That's, that's just a darker. The ceilings are so light. Sort of screen that they put on. If the main control room on the left in, in a minute it might is in good condition, it's going to be a cracker. Yeah. The other one was fire burn, unfortunately, but I've no idea what the this? condition of this one is. This? this might be fireproof. Well, screen. across the middle will be, mate. It's wood. Yeah, watch it. I don't know. This place is trash. Yeah. Do you know what? Apparently, when they decommissioned these, I was told by um, Sue at Portland, she said the MOD come in and they take all the walls off. Um, so they've specifically stripped all the stuff off the walls because they want to make sure there's no papers or anything have been slipped in through the walls. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Sorry. Secret makes papers. Sense. So they strip the walls, the floors, which were wooden. Uh, oak apparently they take all the oak floors and then that's it they just leave it in a hell of a state mm. so no chance of um, you, you may be able to go along the next one and look back yeah. a bit yeah. wow brand new bag trashed already, trashed already yeah. I'm going to the concrete on one. It's in good condition, this one. You can see the. Oh, yeah. You can actually see it's like the toilet um, flecking. What do they call it? Egg, egg shelly. It's flecking, not egg shell. But... Yeah, that's the one. The gents is, I think, the next one. Uh, hang on now. That's still looks a bit very smaller. good quality. It's on both sides. That is, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, concrete. Oh, you said it's wood. Oh, it looks wood. It's so burnt out in these rooms. Yeah, look at this, guys. Right. So, Charcoal slime on the walls. So, this, folks, is what was left of the toilet bomb. They've taken the dunny out. Is the urinal still there? It is, yeah. Yeah, look at that. It's mad, isn't it? And they're sort of taken away in there, the cubicle. Yeah, it's nothing in there. Amazing, isn't it? It's just all this is just left there. When you climb up the ladder and you get onto this little roof bit, which is, which is just a roof, but uh, it gets you up there and you can look yeah, up the top. Still good as up there, aren't they? Yeah, so, that's plenty uh, safe, Alex. The there. I'm going to give that a zero out, a one out of ten in there, mate. This one. Yeah. Steve's found the toilet. Oh toilets. my god! The destruction. That's He's just cool. relying just on this. It's funny how when you, you step on that, the water goes. I know, that's why it's spongy. Oh. I mean, I know that's concrete and it's not going to go anywhere, but it's still just the thought of it. Yeah. Look at this, guys. Just the vastness of this. This room is mental. Guys, be careful. That's still good. Look. It's hanging down. It oh, ain't yeah. going to go nowhere, but it's obviously at some point been a bit boring. Why don't there's oil in there? In here, like in the this looks a bit wow. different, actually. Absolutely fantastic. 
Right, this looks a bit smaller, this, this main control room, to the last yeah, one. Yeah, it does actually. Yeah, because it went back a bit further. It's, this is the same room, it's all one. <laughs> we'll just film it, mate. Oh, it's all hard, mate. That's so we've got all the wooden paneling. There's an old uh, sink there. It must have been like the little... Utility? Yeah, utility room, I suppose. That's new for... Them. Oh yeah, that's where they made the brews. Hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> sausage fest. So there's the toilets. Wow. Are we sitting? Ventilation. Extractor fan. And a little window there. You might be able to get into the pantry. This is... Yeah, I just don't know what these are. Little patch there. Yeah. Oh, expose it. Ah. Oh, yeah. Well, that was? Was when, we, when we were in the last one, there was all the machinery on the floor. Oh, okay. Yeah, and it wasn't flooded either, was it? No. So we could actually walk in there. Side here, I'm taking the wall down into the plant room. It could be to get out some rather large transformers and equipment. They, they, they got it out through the wall rather than through the doorway sideways. They just knocked the wall through. It's just amazing the size of these bunkers, mm. especially with the height of the ceiling, just where yeah. we are basically. I'll chuck a little bit of um, stone in so you can just see. <laughs> just like that. You can see how much the water levels come up because yeah, presumably the door, doors are about six foot six, aren't they? Yes, yeah. And you can see that I can't actually film that, but I will in a second. That's how much it's flooded. Is it accessible then? Yeah. They're all wow. accessible. Yeah, the water levels are right inside. Jump on the bed side. Move along, John. I'm gonna. Thank you, Brent. I'm gonna come off where you are. Oh, I thought we'd get some of Interesting patterns on the wall here, isn't it? It's the big washing machine, mate, or tumble dryer. Yeah. Unit number nine five seven one eight. See the steps down there, mate. Right? Fancy a dip? It's like a shadow. Yeah, it is about three foot. I mean, because it's clear, it also looks. It's just so still and clear, isn't it? It is, yeah. Like, just dropping one, one little bit in there just upsets the whole system, look. And look on the wall, you've got the. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh. I've seen wet. Says shut and open, which yeah. makes sense. Right. So presumably this is a filtered door here, and look how trash that is. It goes down deeper than the sunk, doesn't it? It goes down another double, doesn't it? There's brickwork on there as well. Yeah, it's just this wall here, I reckon. So, I mean, none of this was flooded though at all. No, so it's really it would just be so this sort of. You know, in like the generator room, as we we did. Yeah. That's in like, like some room. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Cables there. It's also yeah. air intake. Yeah, that would yeah, yeah. fill, fill a door. Did you see the door? No. Is that the one that's sixty-seven? I think so. Yeah. 
However, I've got it out. It's a long one to balance on, isn't it? Yeah. It just feels like I shouldn't be able to do it. You're walking on water, mate. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> I'm just going to have a look in here. It's just like a bit of a There we go, folks. So they feel safe enough so far. It's just a balancing act. <laughs> You'll be all right. I've, I've got faith in you, Ray. Oh, look at this, folks. Like an old. Oh, you go. Dunno. Assorted centers. It was old. interesting to see the old relics in there. There's Ray down there. Use my bad hand of balance. Yeah, so he's broken two fingers. No, he's broken my neck half. And this is exactly like the old bunker was we went to. At the end. But they haven't spared much money to do this. I have to say. Yeah, there's nothing. Ah. Yeah. Well, it's yeah. Oh, right in front of you. Yeah. So we got 1967. I'll just zoom up, guys. Thursday, September 20, it's either 21st or 27th, 1967, page 35. That's crazy. Just turn it over. Be careful the stairs don't give way. Just go in the middle and balance, it's probably easier, mate. Yeah. That piece of concrete in the middle is like a massive gap in the middle of it, isn't it? Didn't even realise I was walking across it. <laughs> Do you want me to take your gimbal? You can reach the gimbal then, yes, please. It's it's cool. That's it, but... There you go. Yeah. Well, it's alright, I'll keep it managed. Did you um, notice how much deeper the sump goes? For yes, the, yes, it's a hell double again, isn't it? Yeah. No, you said my phone's broken enough as it is. <laughs> <laughs> Look at him! Look at him doing it all in one, oh, folks. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> yes, <laughs> mate. <laughs> parkour. What about a parkour? Yeah. So guys, there's another bit of the paper that um, Ray found. British funds, London Stock Exchange. Oh, there's another bit of paper here, folks. Look at this. And on the wall, which have got the It's so cool to see these old papers. Let's turn it over. 
it's just very soft. It's literally just crumbling. So I'm not going to try not handle it too much. But yeah, look at that. So yeah, we are just um, heading back to the start now. But yeah, these rooms are just so massive. It is. It's just crazy to just to think this is underground. One thing I did miss, guys, is there is actually a full paper page here. Look, let's just open this up. Set my light down. It's a whole paper page. Look at this. So this one is September sixth or fifth, is that? Nineteen sixty-seven. It's just so cool. Let's see if I can open it up because it is a, it's actually a page, I believe. Let's just see. Yeah, look at this. Women now get over £15 a week as London traffic wardens. So that just goes to show you how the wages and inflation has changed over the years. Absolutely crazy stuff. And if you want to read more of this, just obviously pause the video and um, have a look. It's a shocker. Serious. Just show you the back page. Yeah, just can't believe it. Absolutely crazy. Right, folks, well, that concludes um, the Wimbledon Common Rut Bunker. So, I hope you enjoyed that one. Um, again, go and look at our other Rut Bunker we did at Beachy Head probably three or four months ago. That was a cracker. They are very similar, um, but slightly different. Uh, I think the old one, or the last one we went to, had some more, more in it in terms of structural stuff and this one's got more relics in but yeah really cool one definitely worth coming along to look at so yeah drop a like if you enjoyed the video drop a, a comment let us know what you thought and well as always thanks for watching and we will see you in the next video cheers guys